Hello guys and good morning. How are you doing today? I am doing very, I am very optimistic today and I am very motivated today. So today is a good day for Marissa. It has been quite some time. I am very sorry for that. But on the other hand, I feel like where my channel left off was a great way to demonstrate my mental health and now almost 10 months later I can actually talk to you guys about how much my life has changed once I really did bring in self-love. I chose myself, I burned so many toxic bridges and I just really took care of myself and my life has literally 180. I can't even. So I'm really excited that I get to share everything all over again but with the fact that it actually happened and that these things are fully possible and you can literally change your mind, your identity, and be whoever you want all over again no matter how big and toxic your mistakes and past are. And I think that is such an important reminder from human to human because there are times in our lives in my previous videos where you're just at your literal rock bottom and you don't think that there's another side and then when you finally see the other side and you're actually able to relax and breathe and realize you are on that final side it's game over and is one of the most magical things you can do for yourself I'm 26 now and I can easily say I have gone through like five identities and that's not a bad thing. You want to be changing as much as you possibly can in this lifetime. And for that, let's go into a little bit of a life update. So a lot really has changed in the past 10, 11 months. Oh my God, I can't believe how long it's been. I'm just going to list off everything that's going on and pro probably put some videos in with that. So life update. I have been in a healthy relationship for a year and a half now and when I say healthy relationship I genuinely mean just like the most, like don't get me wrong, we have our fights, we have our disagreements, we have our things that we have to work on, we're not perfect, but there's just like this certainty that uh, I like prayed for this certainty my whole entire life. Like I prayed for this comfort, I prayed for this feeling and to know that it was right around the corner in so many of my darkest times is just crazy to think. This year has definitely made me fully understand the balance of light and dark, happiness and sadness. It's like you're constantly just trying to be right here in the middle and balancing the two and that is where happiness lies. That is where the magic happens because there is no good without bad. There is no light without darkness. And realizing that this year and really grasping that oof, has made all the difference in my perspective. At 25 years old, I officially became a business owner and I own my own nail salon in Los Angeles on Melrose Avenue, a very iconic street. Um, sometimes I have to pinch myself that what I just said is real, but it is real and it's about to be my business for a year now. Literally a year now. I can't believe it took me like a year to announce that on my YouTube channel, but yeah. I own and I genuinely believe self-care is health care that is like my logo in this lifetime just like you are what you think about don't forget that I didn't see it coming but I found my journal from when I was 17 and I literally wrote in my journal own a business by 25 and I had no idea I literally forgot all about that and when I found that journal I read that and I already was 25 and owned a business I was like is why you journal and that is why you manifest like I literally didn't even remember writing that but because I let it go and I just didn't think about it and I just trusted the universe the universe was like <laughs> earlier in this channel I used to be beyond lonely 
I think, or I know I didn't have any friends. And I was just in a really dark place. I was really isolated. And part of this life update is I have literally some of the best friends walking this planet right now. And for that, I'm just, man, life does not understand how grateful I am for that one. I have always struggled with friendships. I don't know what it is. It's probably some subconscious thing, which I know it is. Um, but this past year slash two years, I have done nothing but be healing my childhood and going to therapy with my mom, having those uncomfortable conversations, writing those uncomfortable letters, really sitting in forgiveness meditations and cutting away the life cord strings and just doing hypnosis where I revisited my childhood and you know forgive the memory and I go there with my adult self and I hold my inner child's hand and I say like it's okay we make it out of this and like we have a happy life and I'm gonna take care of you is just do it like Ah, oh God, whatever you do, just heal your inner child if you ever endure childhood trauma to the slightest bit. Like, just work on that inner child. Make sure that they're at a mature age because, man, oh, man. I'm grateful. I'm so grateful. I really, I really buckled down and took care of that. And I still continue to do that. That's not over. I still, you know, sit here and I work on myself. So yeah, this is like my random life update slash choose yourself always because I feel like, as you guys know, I'm such a firm believer in sharing your knowledge and just spreading your art and I really feel like my YouTube channel is one of my favorite therapy tools and if you've never talked into a camera and just word vomited about your mental health i highly suggest it it is one of my favorite things to do and sometimes just hearing yourself back and seeing your opinions on things even three months later and how much they've changed it just really gives you an opportunity to self-reflect and i think my YouTube channel is one of my greatest tools on self-reflecting and I just can't wait to bring that back hopefully in my everyday life not hopefully I will be bringing that back into my everyday life and I just really want to dive into so many more of my mental health workouts my emotional intelligent workouts um, my little rituals for full moons and winter solstice and the age of Aquarius which you all know we are now in and also I have my meditation singing bowls which I really and I mean really want to bring into my channel so if you guys are interested in my meditation singing bowls please leave a comment below letting me know that you would want to do a meditation with me I just really felt like everything I talked about in my channel, I had to prove. I couldn't really talk about it anymore unless I had real proof that, you know, I can, I did, I'm doing these things and they really do change your life. I'm not just talking to talk. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this random little video and I really plan on seeing you guys very soon. As in, I'm probably going to film another video right after this, so be prepared. <laughs> and yeah, so have a wonderful day. And don't forget, you are what you think about. Bye!